What's up YouTube, Politics Gaming here, and today I am bringing you part two of the Republic of Turkey um, on Geopolitical Simulator 4. And uh, uh, last time I really just tried to get the economy back up and running. Um, we've been doing a little bit of a good job. Um, my interest rate is, or no, my inflation rate actually is uh, going down. And so we're going to keep it uh, the way it is. Um, we've lowered our deficit. And um, overall, we've been doing a pretty good job um, running the, the economy. And um, uh, I believe it was last time, or uh, whenever I wasn't recording, actually. Um, but I launched an airstrike against uh, ISIS, and I do have air clearance over Syria, but for some reason uh, me and Syria are in a conflict. So what I'm going to do now is that I'm going to send 11,000 troops from there, and another 5,000 from here. And we're going to align them on the border. Of Syria. Oops. Some five tanks. Let's line them over there where Kurdistan is. And let's move. Um. So now we are going to look at some of the laws that we might start passing. Uh, growth, we've been increasing in growth, so that's good. Um, parliament, determine the powers of parliament and their confidence against the head of state. Um, let's go ahead and put a couple laws. And maybe you can start lowering taxes. Income. That. Hmm, we don't have that big of a middle class, apparently. Let's lower that to 20%. Let's take a poll. Left. Okay. Oh, cancel that. Let's lower that by one percent. Depending to the people that you know, come on, you're like getting your taxes lowered. Unless like we have a huge. Yeah, we have a really really big uh, lower class. Exonerations for real estate. Mm, let's go ahead and take a poll. People wouldn't like that. <laughs> let's go ahead and start with working on our lower class. Um, hmm. Budget. 84 billion on social security. Um, we're going to definitely have to start paying off our debt so we can start uh, maybe um, putting more money in education and definitely employment. Um, let's go ahead and get these troops on the border with Syria. Alright, Panama just suffered an earthquake. Let's send one million dollars. Great disapproval. No, we're not going to withdraw. Um, let's all go ahead and start paying people more. And 
see how much approval we get from that. Okay. <sighs> Immigration. Establish aid. Maybe we can start giving aid. Uh, we could get it passed. Barely. 88%, 76, and 74. 75% for. Um, let's go ahead and do a basic subsidy. Integration, anti racism, controlled immigration. Alright, we got the Syrians moving their troops on our border. These important troops are positioned near our borders and represent a potential threat to our territorial integrity. Right. Faced with this threat, I can, with your agreement. No, I got, I got it. Where are those? Anchor at that. else can we do against Syria? Maybe, actually, yeah. Let's do this. Secret Service. Ten. Political spying. We have to keep... Maybe I can find a... reason to get the UN to go against them. Um, let's check our justice system. Prison population 0 0.092. Legalized death penalty, which is actually what the um, Aragon, I believe that's how you say his name, um, prim the president of uh, Turkey is uh, wanting Congress to legalize it so he can use it against the people who conspired the coup um, that happened a couple days ago. Um, let's see. Sales limited to hunting arms, which must, must adhere, adhere to the license system and under, undergo inquiry. Um, cancel that. Determine the power. Let's see if we could get that passed. Make a little more freedom. The opinion of the people, oh my god. Training like to fund that. And ninety days vacation. Um let's go ahead and build up oh, what? The bill has been voted on, and the law has been passed. Sweet. And, um... Service. Let's go ahead and look at our energy situation. Fossil energy, 72.7%, and second one is hydraulic energy. 0% funding. National consumption, production, so we overtook our production. Maybe we can, maybe we can kind of go start going nuclear energy. Um, I would have to look into that. Um, because oh my god, two billion manpower to allocate. Um, let's go ahead and maybe we can start dismantling some of this. Um, 
Uh, nuclear power isn't in there. Hold on. Do I have to research it? Discoveries. Discoveries in the world. Nuclear fission. Research tree, nuclear fission. Huh. Nuclear electricity and nuclear submarines. Oh, okay. Well, we're gonna have to maybe try and research that. I kind of like the research tree. I wish it um, maybe was a little more expanded upon, um, but I do like the research tree. Paralyzed molecule. <laughs> Minist run by the Minister of Education. Patents researched for year seven. Nobel <laughs> Prizes won. So yeah, we definitely need a boost of research. I mean, uh, education and research. Number of high education students, one million. So, nuclear energy was under matter sciences, so let's fund matter sciences. And then let's also boost, boost energy and environment. Oh, we got a meeting request from Yemen. And agri-food. So that's about a billion dollars we're going to be spending on research. Let's hope we get our money back. <laughs> Thank you for taking care of ecology. Got you a are lot giving our country. Refugees, environment, and research, definitely. So let's go ahead and accept that. Yeah, man, we have good relations with them. They're in a conflict right now. I believe that is the Yemeni, uh, Yemeni civil war. Um, both finances, agriculture, and energy. So, let's go ahead. Nope, not dismantle. Let's build one. Onshore, let's make go ahead and make a tenth one. That here, let's see how much we get. Get good, okay. Our info. All right. Let's see what we can find on this area in government. Maybe we can put something into the UN. Price of electricity. Where's an environment? There it is. We will ratify? No. Okay, let's go ahead and ratify the piece of the Paris Accords. 71.3% passage, so we're gonna go ahead and get that passed. Maybe we can give people tax credits. Ooh, that's expensive. Okay, there's a meeting with Good Yemen. morning! Okay. They want to purchase oil from us. Between Yemen and Turkey, annual quality purchase. So, I don't know, sometimes this confuses me. They're wanting to purchase it from us. Yeah. Yeah, they don't have any uh, oil production. And they're wanting to buy our production, which we don't have. Um, production over consumption, so. I don't know. 
gonna go ahead and refuse that. Drop sure. A coffee. Our country is. Say that. <laughs> and maybe we can get a non-aggression pact with them now. Crime rate is going down, that's good. And. Command retreat with foreign troops, Cyprus, and the United States. Conflicts involving Turkey, let's see that before we go ahead and head out. Oops, not Tunisia, Turkey. Russia, we have a hostility with Russia, and then we also have a hostility with. Syria, we also have conflict with the ISIS and hostility with Cyprus. Uh, can I click Russia? Someone when you click it. Hmm. And family. Conception rate of 73%. And population growth is 1%. It's going down, though. And we also still have that military alliance with Georgia. So that's good. So we have a nearby ally. Um... I don't think we would want to pursue closer ties with Iran, and maybe we, next time we can uh, go ahead and get in alliance with Iraq. So, guys, huh, that's ironic. Our network has been partially disbanded. <laughs> Our network. Ha Damn. Well, guys, if you like this video, go ahead and uh, leave a like and subscribe, and also share this video with people who like Geopolitical Simulator 4. And um. I hope to see you guys next time. Alright, take care.